look down, look all around. Up in the air or on the ground. Come for a walk, come for a ride. There's so much to see, so come outside. We're packed in a packet with plenty of air. Open it up and you'll see. We're all very thin. We crackle and crunch. What do you think we could be? We're crisps. Oh, hello, my dears. A few friends are coming round later. And I always like to give them something to eat. In the bin, please, Pippin. I think that's everything. Oh, crisps. I forgot to buy some. You stay here, Pippin. I won't be long. Steak and onion, pickled onion, tomato sauce. I think I'll have a bag of cheese and onion. Thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye, Auntie. crisps come from? We'll go and find out. Pippin! It's time to fly! potatoes grow. This field is full of potatoes, but you can't see them because they're growing under the ground. That's a good idea, Pippin. We'll dig some up and show you. It's all right for us to do this, because the potatoes are finished growing and they're all going to be dug up today. There we are. That's what crisps are made from. Potatoes. 
and this is how they grow. A special potato called a seed potato is planted in the ground. It grows a shoot and the shoot grows long thin roots. They take food from the potato to help them grow. The shoot grows up above the ground where its leaves appear. The roots spread out under the ground and drink water from the earth to feed the plant. Flowers appear on the plant and the shoot grows some thick stems. The flowers die and the plant grows some fruit. This fruit is poisonous but under the ground on those thick stems tiny new potatoes start to grow. They grow bigger and bigger and soon they're big enough to eat. And then they're ready to be dug up. How many have we dug up, Pippin? One potato, two potato, three potato, four, five potato, six potato, seven potato, more. I'm glad I don't have to dig up all the potatoes in this field. Even with Pippin's help, I'd be here for a week. No, they have a machine to do that. And here it comes now. Long. Would you like a nice biscuit to eat while you're waiting? Aren't you hungry? It's most unusual. Oh well, I'll leave it here in case you change your mind. See you later, Pippin. Potatoes are going to be washed and peeled. Then the potatoes are sorted. The small ones go through, and the big ones are cut in two to make them smaller. Mary, Julie, and Linda are checking to make sure the potatoes have no bad bits in them and that they're all the right size. Then off they go to be sliced up in this machine. Checked by a computer. 
Only the best get through. All cooked and ready to eat? Not yet. What do they need now? Flavor. This is where the flavors are added. Roast chicken. Smoky bacon. Sausage and tomato. Oh, and my favorite, cheese and onion. The flavor is in the powder. It's mixed up with the crisps. Now they'll taste of cheese and onion. This machine weighs the crisps and drops just the right amount into the bag. They're packed into bags full of air so they don't get crushed or broken. And now they're ready to sell in the shop. Didn't eat your biscuit, Pippin. I hope you're not ill. Come along, time to go home. Out in the fields, they dig up potatoes, all different sizes, but all of them round. Out in the fields, they dig up potatoes, dig up potatoes from under the ground. What happens next? They wash the potatoes, wash the potatoes, then peel off their skin. That's what they do. Then slice the potatoes, slice the potatoes in slices quite thin. What happens next? They cook all the slices, cook all the slices until they are done. That's what they do, then put in the flavor, tasty and crunchy, their crisps every one. What happens next? They put them in packets, put them in packets, all crinkly and new. That's what they do, they put them in packets, to sell in the shops, just for me and for you. Guess will be here soon. It's the air in the bag that makes it pop like that. And now you know all about crisps. In the bin, please, Pippin. Mm -hmm. 